Hi everybody, we're in the middle of Fox and Friends. We're coming up on Kill Me and Friends between 9 and noon on XM Sirius 126. And hopefully your local station, we're going to analyze last night's debate. I know you don't watch MSNBC, but we did. And recap it, we'll have the best sound bites of the night. Rick Perry's first debate in four years, and he was the number one target because he's the number one guy. Mitt Romney has never looked better. We'll get you make your own judgment. Newt Gingrich, like everyone predicted, when the debate started, if he was still around, he would make some important points, and he has. And he's got two more debates. U.S. News and World Report said Newt is the comer so far on the Republican side. Do you agree? We're going to play some of the back and forth between Mitt and uh, between Mitt and Governor Perry and see if you've changed your mind at all. We're also going to discuss with one of the experts, the premier in the business, Dr. Larry Sabato of the University of Virginia. Steve Ducey will come up and offer his analysis, insight, and we'll take a ton of your calls. Chris Wallace must have been smiling when Brian Williams was targeted verbally by Newt Gingrich because he was targeted by Newt Gingrich as well. How does he feel about Brian Williams getting the media is the bad guy treatment? We'll find out. Joe Daniels is the president of the September 11th Memorial Museum. Joe Daniels joining us. One of the big controversies is first responders listed along with everyone else. Shouldn't they have their own category? In my mind, the answer is yes. Fox News legal analyst and five panelists, Kimberly Guilfoyle. First time we're together in quite some time. You should watch on uh, KillMeToFriends.com to see if there's any tension. And John Yu will be joining us. He's the author of Confronting Terror. John Yu is the one who said, yeah, you get Khalid Sheikh Mohammed, I'm giving you legal authority to give him uh, waterboarding or whatever it takes to get him to talk. John Yu will talk about how we should be treating these Al-Qaeda prisoners when we get them and more. All coming up on Kill Me and Friends. See you then.